Heading into the winter of 2016, Namibian super lightweight Julius Ndongo seemed like just another unheralded contender inching his way forward in the boxing world. Forget the fact that nobody outside and scant few inside his African homeland had ever heard of him, the 2008 Olympian is also a 6'1 southpaw whose lanky, reaching style promises more headaches and challenges than most leading contenders or world champs care to bother with. Indeed, Ndongo's path to fame seemed a long and winding one. Then, one snowy Moscow December evening, Russian IBF super lightweight champion Edward Troyanovsky was 40 seconds into what was supposed to be another one-sided showcase against an anonymous imported foe when this happened. Edward trying to come in. Julius trying to throw that uppercut. Completely missed it, but... Oh! He is out! What a left hook! Rushing Whoa. left hook right to the jaw! Julius Ndongo, incredibly, was a world champion. With all his inherent style anomalies and no real reward to show for the risk, the choice of Ndongo as an opponent was one of the most egregious matchmaking blunders seen in some time. But charmed by the glint of Ndongo's shiny new IBF belt, promoter Eddie Hearn may have just made the same mistake, inking the Namibian to a tantalizing April 15th unification bout in Glasgow. With his star charge at 140 pounds, WBA champion, Scotland's own Ricky Burns. Of course, unlike Troyanovsky, Hearn thinks Burns, a three-division world champion, won't be frozen in bewilderment and in Dongo's angles of attack, and should provide a much more elusive target for the towering Namibian. If that's indeed the case, the antidote to Ndongo's unique fighting physiology would be made public, and the trap door back to boxing obscurity could swing open. Conversely, if Burns falls into the same trap as Troyanovsky, or his guile and experience corrodes into age and wear and tear, or maybe Ndongo just proves too complex a riddle for even an astute veteran like Burns, then boxing's most unlikely world champion, Julius Ndongo, could very well be its newest unified superstar. <laughs>